Today's power tap is connecting to your true nature. It's time to return home. Join me in these power taps and let's awaken your dreams. With all the busyness of life and all of the challenges and troubles we're often faced with, sometimes it's hard to connect to our true nature. Yet it's our true nature that allows us to deeply connect into our truth, our wisdom, find deep peace, and also connect to that place within ourselves that feels like home. Here are some signs that perhaps you need to connect to your true nature. You are feeling lost and confused. Life is overwhelming you. You are seeking answers but don't know where to start. You are experiencing pain physically, mentally or emotionally. You are looking for inspiration and creative insight. You just want to feel like you again. All of these are signs that perhaps it's time for you to connect to your true nature. I myself have often felt disconnected. Here's what's happened to me. Living in the city, I often forgot to put my bare feet on the earth. And as a result, walking around feeling disconnected from the earth, people in my life and myself. Life may have seemed to be glamorous, yet if I'm disconnected from myself, nothing feels good. I have found that if I keep spiraling out of control in this direction without connecting to my true nature, things just get worse. I start to feel frustrated and overwhelmed at work. My relationships suffer because I start to depend on them for my happiness. I start to feel disconnected from my joy. This is why I have found it so important to connect to my true nature. This is what I do. Taking naked strolls in nature. Yes, barefoot and bare bum. Meditating to the sounds of nature, the wind, the birds, and the moving leaves. Laying underneath the stars at night. And digging holes in the earth with my dog. So today, I invite you to join me in this power tap to discover your true nature as we dive deep and find that new place of home, sitting in a comfortable position. Okay. So let's just massage underneath the collarbone to start with. And I want you to tune into this disconnection from your true nature. Feel what that disconnection feels like. Perhaps there's a void feeling, some isolation, loneliness. Tune into what that disconnection feels like for you. And then repeating after me, if the word isn't completely accurate, just change it to match your story. And that way we'll get through to the other side. Beautiful. Tapping the center of the chest. Even though I feel really disconnected from my true nature, I'm open to loving and accepting myself. Tapping between the brows, this disconnection that I'm feeling. Tapping the temples, I really don't know how to find my true nature. Take a big deep breath, big sigh. Tapping the cheeks, I forgive myself for feeling disconnected from my true nature. Tapping underneath the nose, I forgive myself for feeling disconnected from the world. Disconnected from myself. And what else are you feeling disconnected from right now? I'm feeling disconnected from, and just name what it is. Take a big deep breath, big sigh. Ah, good. Tapping the center of the chest. I'm feeling really disconnected right now. And I just want you to feel that right now and just hold it in some compassion. Hold that disconnection, that feeling of not really feeling at home. Feel what that feels like. And how does it feel in your body? What's the texture of it? It feels like, and just name what it feels like. Take a big, deep breath, big sigh. <sighs> Good, you're doing great. Tapping the front of the ribs. It feels like, name what the disconnection feels like. I feel really lost. I feel really confused and overwhelmed. I don't feel at home right now. And I really want to feel more peace. I forgive myself for feeling disconnected and overwhelmed. 
I forgive myself for not knowing how to find my own rhythm. Tapping the next finger, take a big deep breath. Ah, beautiful. Tapping the next finger. I love and deeply accept myself exactly as I am. Even if I remain disconnected forever. Tapping the next finger. It's possible I'm still worthy of love. It's possible I'm still a good human being. Tapping the opposite side of the next finger. Even if I remain disconnected for the rest of my life. Wow. I'm still a good human being. And it's possible that I'm still worthy of love. Even though I've been really struggling here. Tapping the side of the hand and I don't know how to find my happy place. I don't know how to find my peace. I don't know how to find my true nature. Big deep breath, big sigh. Ha! <sighs> Good. Tapping the top of the head, around the head. I love and deeply accept myself exactly as I am. And it's possible my love can help me find my true nature. It's possible this love can make me feel at home. Tapping between the brows, it's possible this love will help me feel more peace. And what else could this love do for you if you really let yourself receive all of this love right now? What could it help you receive? What could it help you do? What could it help you feel? It could help me and just name what it is for you. Tapping the cheeks. This love could help me with, and name what it is. Tapping underneath the nose. And I really want to feel that. But I've been struggling so much. I've been feeling so disconnected. Tapping underneath the lips. I'm ready to give myself the love I deserve. Even if the world isn't giving it to me. I'm ready to give it to myself. Big deep breath, big sigh. <sighs> I forgive myself for feeling distracted and overwhelmed. I don't want to be distracted anymore. I just want to feel my true essence. And if you were to imagine what your true essence would feel like, what would it feel like? Your true essence. And I want to hear three words that your true essence would feel like if you could feel it. Tapping the side of the ribs. What would it feel like? Those three words. It would feel like, and name what it is, if I could feel my true essence. Tapping the side of the wrist. It would feel like, name it again, those three things, if I could feel my true nature. And I really want to feel that. And I've been trying so hard to get the world to give it to me. How in your own life have you been trying to get that from the outside world? What have you been doing to try to get those feelings? I have been, and just name what you've been doing in the outside world trying to get it. I have been, and just name what it is, tapping the next finger, but it's not helping me. I have been, and name what you've been doing trying to get those feelings, but it hasn't been connecting me to, to my true nature. Tapping the next finger. I have been, and name what you've been doing, trying to get those feelings. And it hasn't been working. I feel even more disconnected. And it hasn't been working. Tapping the opposite side of the next finger. I forgive myself for overwhelming myself. I've just been trying to get to my true nature and it hasn't been working. I've been trying so hard 
I've been really pushing myself. I've been feeling really stuck. And what else have you been feeling? What's the struggle felt like to you? It's felt, to name what it is. And just feel what that feels like right now. Feel what that struggle has been for you. Tapping the side of the hand. And now I want you to times that struggle by 50%. Like really feel it. Because the way we heal it, the way we let go of it, is we feel it. And when we let go of it, voila, we find our true nature again. So let's feel the struggle, let's feel the pain, let's feel the disconnection, let's feel the trappedness that you're having right now. And I want you now to times it by 75%, really get intimate with that uncomfortable feeling. Tapping the roof of the head. Great, now times it by 100%, really go there just for a moment, really lean into it, let yourself go into all of that uncomfortability, all of that struggle, all of that overwhelm, all of that not knowing. Big deep breath, big sigh. <sighs> Beautiful, nice. I'm surrendering the struggle now. It's possible if I let go of struggling, I'll find my true nature. Tapping the cheeks. Do you think that's true? Like the moment you stop struggling, the moment you let go of the struggle, what do you think is there? Probably more peace, probably more clarity. Aha, uh -huh, perhaps that's your true nature. So let's tune into the struggle. Even though I thought I needed this struggle, Tapping underneath the nose. I thought the struggle was helping me. The struggle is not helping me. Tapping underneath the lips. The struggle between me and, and name what it is, perhaps it's a challenge you're faced with, perhaps it's a situation, perhaps it's the way you're approaching your life. The struggle between me and, perhaps it's someone else is not helping me connect to my true nature. Tapping the center of the chest and I'm ready to let it go now because I want to feel my true nature again. I want to feel my true self. Big deep breath, big sigh. <sighs> Beautiful, tapping the side of the ribs. I love and deeply accept myself exactly as I am and I forgive myself for how hard it's been so just tune into how long you've been struggling with this tune into any blame that you've had towards yourself around it and just send a big wave of forgiveness right now really let yourself feel the forgiveness for the struggle and any blame that you've had towards yourself of being disconnected just send some forgiveness, some compassion to yourself right now. Let yourself feel that compassion. Take a big, deep breath, release a big sigh. <sighs> Beautiful. Tapping the side of the thumb. I love and deeply accept myself. And I'm ready to be free now. Tapping the next finger. I'm ready to relax now. I'm ready to take it easy. Tapping the middle finger. I'm ready to, and what are you ready to do that really honors your true self now? I'm ready to, and just name it. Perhaps it's an action item. Perhaps it's something that you're going to do for yourself. I'm ready to, and just name what it is. Tapping the opposite side of the next finger. I'm ready to, name what it is. And how does it feel when you do that for yourself now? It feels really, and name what it feels like, top emotion. Tapping the little finger. It feels really, name it again, when I, and name what you're going to do. And that's honoring my true self. Wow, so when you do that, your true self gets honored, and that gives you all of those feelings that you like. So perhaps if you did more of that, you would be honoring your true self more and your true self would get to show up more. And does that help you see that these positive emotions that come out of that are actually your true self expressing itself? 
So let's tap the side of the hand. Let's tune into what that gift is that you get to give to yourself right now. Close your eyes, tune in your, to yourself really receiving that gift. Perhaps it's something you're doing, perhaps it's just meditating. Whatever it is, imagine that right now. How does that feel in your body when you do that? How does that relax your life? How does it change your perception of reality? Does that feel like a relaxation into yourself when you do that for yourself? Feel that all the way now, times it by 50%, all of the positive feeling, times it by 75%. Really let yourself soak up what that would feel like to really give yourself permission to have that. Times it by 100% now, really go there. Take a big, deep breath, release a big sigh. <sighs> Tapping the front of the ribs. I love and deeply accept myself. And I can do this whenever I want to. I can come home to my true nature whenever I want to. Tapping the side of the wrist. It feels good to come home to my true nature. It feels good to what? What do you do when you're in your true nature? It feels good to, just name that again. And I'm doing that more in my life now. Tapping the side of the thumb. I now want you to imagine your whole life, all the days ahead of you that are being nourished by this one activity. Imagine you doing this activity every day, every hour if you want to. Imagine how that would affect your relationships. Imagine how that would affect how you show up in the world. Imagine your life totally taken care of as you take care of yourself in this way, take care of your true nature. Feel how your life opens up. See it happening right now as your life opens up. How do you feel in your life when you're really gifting yourself with that? Take a big, deep breath, release a big sigh. <sighs> so tapping all over your body. And I want you to tune into your life and how that looks when you're giving that all to yourself, all of those good gifts to honor your true nature doing those things that really serve your life, serve who you are, allow you to find that true peace within again. And how does that feel when you give that to your life? I want to hear 10 affirmations out loud, tapping all over your body about how it feels. Does it feel joyful? Does it feel peaceful? Do you feel more gratitude? Do you feel connected? What do you feel? I feel really... Say it out loud, 10 of them. I feel really, really claim it out loud and feel what it feels like when you let yourself feel that. It feels really, keep going, just a few more. I feel really when you're honoring your true self, when you're taking care of your being. Beautiful, just one more. It feels really. Big, deep breath, big sigh. <sighs> Beautiful. And just closing your eyes right now, resting for a moment, relaxing into your own being, feeling the spaciousness inside your being right now. The space where you can really breathe the space where you can let go. Feel that spaciousness right now. Take a deep breath into that, release a sigh. <sighs> Placing one hand on your belly, one hand on your heart. Just tuning into the rhythm of the body, the gift of the body. Feeling the love move through your hands into your body, the nurturing, the care the ease and the grace. Take another deep breath. Just feeling the silence in your being where there's nowhere to go and nothing to do. The spaciousness in your heart that's happy to be right here, right now. Take another deep breath in. 
Release another sigh. Awesome. Thank you so much for joining me in this power tap to discover and connect to your true nature. It's such an important gift that you have that you always have available to you whenever you decide to really drop in and let go. I inspire you to do this power tap whenever you feel disconnected so that you can let the true rhythm of your soul express through your life. I would love to hear how this tap went. Let us know in the comments below. If you want to check out more of my power taps, head on over to YouTube or you can follow us on Facebook, Twitter or Instagram. I always love to hear from you and I'll see you in the next round. Bye for now. With all the busyness and all the troubles and dilemmas we're often faced with in life. Hey! Uh, PT 36, take two. It's sometimes hard to really connect to your true self, true nature. All right, yeah. true nature. Ready? Okay. okay. All righty. We's a rolling. Ready, ready, ready. Ready, ready, ready. Oi, oi, oi. Okay. <laughs> yeah. yeah.